Hello, my name is Jon from Restoration.bike and in this video I'm going to show you how to polish aluminium bike parts. The first thing we needed to do was to get it out. Now it was seized shut, which is usually the case with these old bikes. But a loosening the bolt and a gentle tap with a, a hammer on a piece of wood is usually enough. And then the next step and an obvious step also is to remove the rust before I will start with the sanding and polishing step. Basically, any um, polishing of, of aluminium bike parts involves sanding it first, or rather cleaning it first, as you can see here, and then sanding it in various steps. Now, what I found is that when you try to get that super shine, that, that mirror finish back, um, especially with, with old and used parts, they are damaged. Um, so they have deep scratches and sometimes rather extensive damage, as you can see here. And the first step in the sanding process is to use a rather coarse grit, and I use a 80 grit here. And this step involves the most time because this coarse grit is used to get all of those scratches out. And here you can see how much effort it takes to get one of the nicks out. Um, and it takes a long time. Uh, this entire process involves like two to three hours. So take your time and be patient. Uh, from the 80 grit, I move upwards to 150 grit, then a 240 grit before I move into wet sanding. So this is probably the first wet sanding step, which is a 400 grit. Then I use a 600 grit and I end up using an 800 grit. And then I turn over to my machine polisher. Um, using a bit of coarse sandpaper to get the old cutting compound off. The sand polisher has two wheels, a coarse wheel, which is this yellow one and uh, one on the other side which is a white one this is used for cutting so basically it's a um, you put on um, um, a piece of sandpaper on the wheel which is translate uh, translate to a really uh, really fine grid like up in the thousands to get uh, the scratches that are still on there from the 800 get sandpaper to get them out. Um, there are four polishing steps involved, two for each wheel, and you uh, they correspond to various color codes on the polishing material which you put on the wheel. So basically it's the same as sanding, polishing, 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 and then um, you get to that mirror finish. Take your time, there's no other way. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe and drop a like. If you have any questions or suggestions for new videos, leave a comment below. You can also visit the website restoration.bike for more background information. Wish you all the best with your own bike restorations and I hope to see you on the next video.